Hi, Pete Riopelle. This video provides an overview of center of gravity analysis. Joint publication defines a center of gravity as a source of power that provides moral or physical strength, freedom of action, or will to act. In other words, a center of gravity is always a strength, not a weakness. It is an adversarial actor trying to achieve his desired end state while denying you the ability to achieve yours. It exists in context, meaning that a different center of gravity may exist for each phase of an operation or with a change of operation. The center of gravity is analyzed within the framework of the three critical factors of critical capabilities, critical requirements, and critical vulnerabilities. The critical capability represents the primary ability, such as destroy, seize, or defend, required to achieve the end state. In other words, it's what the center of gravity is able to do. Critical requirements are the essential conditions, resources, and means the center of gravity requires to perform its critical capability. Critical vulnerabilities are critical requirements that are deficient or vulnerable to direct or indirect attack. They can be transient in nature and exist internally or externally. So, how is the analysis conducted? First, determine the adversary's goal. In this example, the rebels, the British adversary in the southern campaign of the American Revolution, want to eliminate British military presence and loyalist governance and instead establish patriot governance and control. In analyzing the rebels, to accomplish their desired end state, they must establish control and security of the populace, the critical capability. To accomplish this task, the rebels require certain conditions, resources, and means, the critical requirements. The analyst analyzes each of the critical requirements to identify inherent vulnerabilities. These critical vulnerabilities become military objectives along the various lines of operation or effort that focus on disrupting the center of gravity. To identify the center of gravity, we ask ourselves which adversarial entity has the ability to conduct the critical capabilities. In this case, the Patriot Militia is the only rebel entity able to conduct the critical capability and achieve the end state. To prevent a rush to judgment, identification of the center of gravity was delayed until the analysis of the critical factors was completed. For additional information on the elements of operational arts and center of gravity analysis, we recommend the following videos. Thank you for watching this video. Have a good day.